Our next guest, welcome back to the Michael D Show. I'm so glad you're here. Our next guest kind of reminds us of this guest. It's called Rock the Stage uh, with my friend, Rich Trigger Bontrager. Welcome to the Michael D Show. Thank you, Michael. It's great to be here. You know, I'm really excited and I've been watching your work for a long time because I think the saddest thing for us as a book publisher or any author is they launch a book and yet nothing really happens. They don't create a ripple. They don't create a wave. So Trigger, tell us exactly how you're helping authors and what you see as a trend and how we can improve on that trend to get them noticed. Well, a lot of it goes with everything we've been talking about so far is you're not just an author, you're a brand authority. Yeah. So I help media skills now come and help you elevate your brand authority through book launches. That's yeah. one of the most powerful tools. And we've, we've, we've heard it. You need to amplify not just the book, the story, but you are the center of it all. You are the genius behind it all. So I run events, book launches, to help you be seen and heard, plus you get a media tool, the playback, mm -hmm. and use to help elevate over and over again. Well, I think, I think a lot of authors haven't really thought through their talking points. You know, it comes time they've written their book uh, or had somebody book, write the book for them, and it's time to launch the book, but they haven't really thought who the book's for and what the talking points are. So you're helping them with that. Yes. Uh, you're helping building with the that, audience. The branding, sound bites are a yes, big thing. Sound bites are a big thing. And then you're hosting the event, and for four months, you're doing this social media ramp up to for create. For four weeks, not for a month. Okay, for four wow. weeks. Same thing to me <laughs> in, my, in my mind. Okay, so for four weeks, that's a yeah. long time. Yes. So we actually help you amplify it. We help get the story out. We help you get the branding out. But then the big part is also you will have curated content out of that event. So content. not just the whole, yeah, you will not have just the event itself. You have many micro content to go on Instagram, Twitter. So we will help micro generate. Content more content out of one event. So repurpose, what repurpose. The, what we said in the beginning this morning was content creation plus syndication equals monetization. Let me say that again for those of you writing that down in your blank notebooks. Content creation. Hey, yep. listen, I love to cook. Two of my sons are chefs. Why do you think they're so good? They grew up in my house. Content creation. My two sons said, Dad, there's only four food groups. It's all about preparation and presentations. You just rearrange it differently on the plate, right? Okay, what's for dinner tonight? Oh, same thing as last. No, it's different. Content creation yep. plus syndication, and that's where you come in. Yes. You syndicate it everywhere. So even as we do your live streaming publishing event, your book launch, it's live stream, live audience. So you get Q&A uh, time with the live audience. Mm -hmm. Then it's on replay, but it's also multi-streamed by multi-channels. So you can get your own network right now. You literally go live, you'll be yes. on multiple channels with a live audience. So it's not just you, now you have the interaction. And then, like you said, repurpose it, repurpose it, repurpose it. So many authors I know think their book was launched and that's the end of it. Yeah. And you don't miss the replay and the replay. Brief story, did you know that I Love Lucy was the first syndicated replay show ever? No, I did not know that. Desi wow. and Lucy came up with this idea of Back then, it was all play it once and throw it in the trash can. You were never oh, going to see it again. Kidding. And yeah. they literally came up with the idea of what if they watched it again because they missed it the first time. Yeah. MASH, yeah. syndication king, late night TV, yes. you get done and MASH was running. Star Trek, 50 years later, syndication, the original show is still going. And I bet you could track the bottom line revenue numbers with That's that as it. well. That's it. The revenue goes yeah. to the replay, to the replay, to the replay. What if you had more replay content because you had a great book launch to amplify yourself and now you could replay it, have multi-content, yeah. and repurpose it over and over again. It's not a one-shot. Yes. It's a never-ending, it, evergreen, evergreen content. It's evergreen content because I think every author here has evergreen content that's always answering Google's questions when people are typing it in that's going to help them get found. And so, you, I mean, you're capturing the whole event. It's a live event. Yes. You're capturing the comment threads and the, the screenshots, the book reviews, everything. And anyone that registers for your event, you will get the attendance of all the people that join us virtually. It's wow. a virtual event. So now you have contact, you have leads, you have prizes to give mm -hmm. away. You have a bigger funnel to keep going forward. And as you use your media, more podcasts will call you, yep. more TV shows will call yes. you. know this, Michael, yeah. because you got good content. Now they're going to look at it and go, oh, I want you on my show. Yeah, yeah. I, I want you on my podcast. And the engine takes off at a whole new level. How'd you get the name M Trigger? Trigger came actually uh, 30 years of radio TV broadcast. Hanging out with the now famous Kevin Harlan. Uh -huh. uh, I knew him from his days with the Minnesota Timberwolves. We were hanging down in the Target Center, and we were kicking around the idea of how the brand, this crazy guy that pops off and loves sports like a crazy man. And Bontrager doesn't stick well with people. And he said, 
you're always popping off. The phones are always ringing. People love how you twist things around in your warped little mind. And Trigger was born. Trigger. There are six pages of Google. My brand is known so well. More people know me by Trigger than by Rich. Part of your brand story is finding your brand story, finding your brand identity your brand. that Part makes you your unique brand identity. and it will stick. Yes. Go to howmanyofme.com. And when I went to howmanyofme.com, I realized that there weren't just one Michael Butler. There were 613 Michael Butlers. Why do I always get introduced with Michael D? Why do I always have Michael D on all my books? Because I am Michael D. Butler. There's about 10 or 12 Michael D. Butlers. I created one of them, Michael D. Jr. But um, there's 613. If you want to stand out, you got to brand identify what makes you different. And what problem are you going to solve in the marketplace? So, yeah, find that nickname, trigger. find that brand. Trigger, find, trigger. Yeah, trigger works for me. Yes. There, there, there's only one of me. There's only one there's trigger. There's only one rich trigger bond trigger. trigger. You Google it, you will find me. The other thing through your book launches, and this is my passion. Uh, we were talking earlier about what's your dream, what's your passion, yeah. what's your gift. We heard earlier from Tom. The idea is I help you shine on camera. Mm. I want you to outshine me during my interviews, during my show. I will give mm. you softball questions. I will set you up for success. Mm -hmm. So when you give the answers, mm -hmm. you will pop off the screen brighter, sharper, clearer. And again, that lead magnet will go up and up as you hit every home run all night long. Any hair and makeup help? No, not with this face. No. Yes. Uh, <laughs> but you, you do give some media coaching. Yes, Tell us about I the media, media coaching, coaching you coaching. give. That's, that's what I love to do. This is mm -hmm. all. The book launch is a byproduct of the media coaching I do. I help you shine on camera, but I help you learn your voice. What's your story? What's your marquee brand story? Everyone's mm -hmm. got that marquee brand story. Mm -hmm. Yep. I have several that I use. In fact, I overcame a lifelong stutter to be a professional broadcaster. Oh, I did too. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you and I talked about it. We, we both have come out of ministry. We both, both were stuttered. pastors. We're, we're both, both bald. Yes. Yes. And when you start using those stories, what else? you'll find out you're connected to people. You start doing things. Yeah. But that brand story of me telling yeah. my stutter, now I coach professionals to speak it's better good. on stage. When they introduce me on stage, people laugh. I saw you on the C-suite, and of course I saw you yeah. through Leadership Global yeah. and Linda. Well, NSA and, and I now work NSA, together very close. I started seeing you everywhere. And people now are drawn to the guy that stutters that helps you speak better. Mm -hmm. It's part of the shtick. It's part of the label that now you can show people you can defy the odds, you can elevate your brand, you can overcome the adversity. But you got to figure out what your story is, how you're going to tell it, yeah. and how you're going to show up here. Right. How you show up when the lights and the camera go mm -hmm. on makes a world a difference. Because, because so many times when you're done writing, by the time you're done writing the book, you're sick of it. You don't want to talk about it yes. anymore. But you help make it fun. There's prizes. There's giveaways. There's the whole nine yards. I know you've helped a lot of authors with it. I've been watching you do it. And then we're going to do some stuff together. But you've also given us a special price for this group. So yeah. uh, normally it sells for X dollars. And you're giving it to us for how much? Four nine nine five. Okay. Yeah. Forty nine ninety five. Yeah. And it's all bundled in together. You also get coaching with me. And we're adding in a couple of things that you're going to bring from the Epic mm -hmm. side as well, yep. that we're going to get you on magazines and other things as well. Mm -hmm. So you will be seen, heard, and people will know you. So if you want some more information, talk to Trigger and talk to Kirk. Kirk is uh, Captain Kirk there in the uh, control room. He's right running there. around everywhere. Is it 4995, $4,950? Yeah. 4995 Yeah. 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 4995 there we go. There we go. So uh, just, just as a closing thought, uh, give us an example of a client you've been able to help. And then what do you Deanna Singh they're... recently came out with a great book. Deanna Singh has been all over CBS, NBC, everywhere lately. Uh, and the equity, inclusion, that's her main thing right now. Uh, we had a great book launch together. Uh, and it's gone more and viral and viral. The other thing I'll tell you about the book launch, by the way, we're doing all these photos. We're doing all these things here. Mm -hmm. Get a testimony from anybody on your podcast. Get a testimony. If you do a video show, get a testimony. Mm -hmm. Deanna Singh did a testimony. Yeah. I'm using that every day to elevate an amazing guest, a great author, a great speaker, and it shows what I do better. Do that for yourself as well, Michael. Well, thank you very much. Have I, I been it. doing a good job speaking today? Everyone's been doing a great job. This is great, and the room is packed full of geniuses here. And I'm, I'm, I'm amazed. I want to hear more. All right, let's give it up for Rich. <laughs> Trigger. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. You bet. Let's do this. Fine.